Hi, this is Coach Tony Morgan of the Masterful Engineer program. And today's short video is about using the Masterful Engineer program website. Or for short, we'll call it MEP. So the first thing I'm going to show you is how to do a shortcut or add a shortcut onto your desktop so you can view the website from there. Now, you've loaded the website, which you can see. Now we're going to show you, for future reference, how you can make a shortcut and add it to your desktop. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to click there. And if you scroll down, you can see here, click Add to Home Screen. Click on that, and you just press Add. And then that's made a shortcut to your home screen. So for future, you can just click on your home screen and go straight into the website. So now you can see it's on the desktop on the home screen. So we're back on the website. I'm just going to show you a few little features on the website. If you go here, on, we're going to go on the home page, click on home. There again. Let's wait for it to load. And on the home screen, you can see here we've got the search button here. Now you can search for anything. You can search for part numbers, or if you want to know about what sort of tools to use if you're a new engineer, you can search tools. We've got a video on tools, so we're going to just type in the word tools in here and do a search and see what comes up. So there's the word tools and we're just going to click on that there and we're just waiting for it to come up. So we'll just scroll down. So it's in a general section and it's telling you what sort of tools you should have. So there'll be a video, just click on read more, there should be a video in there somewhere it's in there showing you what to do if you want to know about tools so we're now going to do a search say for a Baxi fan so if we type in Baxi fan and then once we found that we'll do the search Because you might not know the part number of the fan so you just need to do a general search and you can then scroll through it yeah just go like that so there's a fan unit suppose that's the one you want there's your part number and you want to see a picture of it just to confirm that this is the one you're looking at and there's a picture of the fan so you've got numerous parts on the website what you can do searches like this to find what you're looking for now suppose you want a fault code you've got a fault code what's come up and you don't know what it is let's try that we're going to put a fault code in and we're going to use say an F4 fault code you can just go to new search And we're going to put an F4 code in. Okay, so we scroll down. So we've got an F4 here, an advisement. Now it could be that might not be the one you're looking for. Let's see if there's any more codes. So we've got some more codes here. This is on a ideal. This is saying a flow for Mister Fault. We've got an F43 and a Frawley. Heat exchanger protection. So we've got various codes, F40 on the Shafato. So we've got numerous fault codes. So there's lots of information, as you can see, on the MEP website. So you can use it for fault finding, giving you information on that. We've even got exploded views as well, so we can show you that as well. We've just done a, a search there. 
but it didn't come up so we're going to try another search that's showing we didn't find it so we'll do another search we've got an exploded view on a glow worm so if we click on read more and then that will come round and scroll down so you can see an exploded view on that, this particular boiler you can zoom in on it by just increasing it like that so you can see we've got loads of detail on our website so these are the great points of the MEP website also you've got the technical side you've got the mindset side of it so you've got loads of information which is continually being updated and that's you know absolutely fantastic for new engineers and existing engineers so if you want to join what we're doing just subscribe to our website you can share this any contacts any engineers you know and we'll all help each other so that's the end of this video thank you for watching and you can subscribe on our youtube channel so thank you for now